What's up? It's true. What's up? It's true. What's up? It's true. Uh, at the highest levels of the stock forms, you find that everybody's the same. At the highest levels of this chakra system, you find that we all connect. Venus is captured the electricity of the sound of thought. It comes from the body. The language comes like that. You understand? Hey, the black sun up in here, up in here, the black sun up in here. Hello, my friends. Hello, my friends. Today, I'm going to be telling you about this world of magic. Today, I'm going to be telling you about how this world of magic came to be. Okay? Now, I want to share with you, I want to tell you a story, but I'm going to make it as factual as possible, you know? So, I'm going to explain to you how we humans actually came to be and what the real story of humans, of us, is. <clears throat> we the story of magic, do you understand? We belong to the story of magic. The real story of humans, us, is based on magic, full functioning magic. So, we need to understand we embody this space of characters as ourselves so let's start what is it what is what is a human you know a human is a character based perception only one perception story of a body a human is a character based perception of a body <clears throat> that the universe creates for its own amusement for its own purpose they call it just to create more of the idea of understanding what this place is or awareness okay so firstly we as the body the magic we possess this feeling inside <clears throat> and that's it there's nothing else that's the only truth you should know okay and the video's done thank you goodbye i'm kidding we possess these feelings now these feelings are structured inside our body as departments, as ideas of thoughts. Now these thoughts, as you understand, these are captured in moments inside our time, inside points of our, where the body is based every time, wherever you say you're something or you're doing something. So it's recorded indefinitely, endlessly, timelessly. So what you are, you, you benefit from the effects. You're not even human yourself, you understand? You benefit from the effect. So at the end of the day, you might have an overall effect <clears throat> of hating this place. Guess what? That would be equal to you having a certain effect after 30 years and deciding, fuck this place, I'm going to be a criminal. That's the effect. So the universe creates such parts inside us. So that's what this story is all about. So these departments are chakras instead. So we only responding to this parts of stories not even in <clears throat> parts as ourselves but in parts where these are firstly they are, they, are, they are derived from different instances so some instances you are playing a character some instances you are playing a spiritual part some instances you are emotional so some echoes are more alive than others some information is more clearer is more defined you hear your voice being more serious being more aware like it's actually talking to you, it, it wants you to, to, to speak or to know something. Sometimes your voice is actually that clear, it's actually that specific. Sometimes it, you just have a whole lot of noise, a whole lot of different voices. Do you understand? That means you have come to that feeling of yourself where it wants to understand itself. Where, where, it's, where it's in a voice form now, that feeling of that moment wants to understand itself in its fullness. And that's what... <clears throat> Chakras are for that's by the now to stay there to be there is to encourage yourself more and more and more of, of practicing that whole thing. That's why this meditation is about you, you are in a journey, you understand. So, now I'm talking about the magic, the gift. The gift comes from where you understand you are born with fully packed ideas and you are being reminded only. Now, this is the last part. Now, this is where you have only you only have the excitement, okay? So, you realize that. The excitement will never be outside. So it's a dream. So you have to have astrological energy. You have to have your aspects. You have to know these things. You have to understand what you having an imagination versus you actually being in a space where you're thinking it's not one thing. You're actually moving your blood, your cells, and you're actually moving the space and time. So you mustn't move faster than your head because it's the same space and time. Picture it like this, when you're sitting next to someone, a friend or a stranger, you know you have different heart rates. 
So now these heart rates are going to take you to different effects. Somebody will make you feel scared because of that person's heart rate. Now that is a specific dream inside you, but it's going to take that person to a different timeline. That information is not going to be the same. So there is no one body or two bodies at the same time and we agree. It's a